Welcome to Plus TV Africa and this is Tea Time where we analyze and dissect the biggest entertainment stories on the planet and this is your favorite entertainment show of course and you know I don't anchor the show alone my name is a fellow Oshika anyways but I'm with the chatty and classy Nimi Adekombi and the eloquent yet politically correct Benny Ak. What's good bro? <laughs> am, I, am I politically correct? Most times you try I, you, 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 so try, you try you <laughs> try. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so should I say daring? Yeah, controversial. More like a controversial. controversial. Yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah. Okay, but most times I see that's politically correct because a lot of people see uh, when you're controversial as you being controversial, but in most cases you're just stating the obvious and yeah. stating the truth. Yeah, what it is. But yeah. it's just how people. Um, Deem it. Yeah. yeah, so it's just it's just perception, basically. Thank you, I'll take that. So how are you guys doing? We're, we're very good. How was your morning? Very, very nice. Your night? Mm, very, very restless. <laughs> very, very restless. And why is that? Yeah. Because you were coming on the show this morning. Good to have you on the show, by the way. Oh, yeah, thank you. My good to have time. you on the show, too. Your first time, right? So we've got to do this for you. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right, so um, let's move to the first story of the day. Right. So is this is Eniola bad news? I mean, is Omotola Jalade being condescending mm. by saying that... Any love bad news? Is she an actress? No, She's an actress, no, by no, the way. No, 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 no. I watched that video, and in fact, the first when I watched the video, I did not get that vibe at all from Omotala. It was more or less like any other bad news. She's an actress, right? Like when you hear any other bad news TV. And you know that there's like an actress mm. called Eniola, but I felt like she was more like more or less like clarifying that mm. it is the actress that owns the TV, not that she did not know who Eniola Badmos was. And I felt like Eniola Badmos coming out on her Instagram page, you know, like, like that was like a raw cut. It wasn't like as soon as it was even out there. It was mm. like maybe she was editing the footage and then now putting it out there. I just thought it was very very weird. But obviously, she saw it somewhere for her to put it out there. That's what she I'm saying. It it's her TV. All right, she was reviewing the footage because if you looked at the video, it was more or less like a raw footage. It, was, it had never gone out on air. So What's she your saw take the, on this? Exactly. I don't think. Maybe because I know the person of Motola Jalade. Okay. Motola Jalade is no one to, to demean or look down on anybody. Yes. I've, been, I've been at occasions where she cited me and she beckoned on me. Mm -hmm. All right, I want to tow a line. She wasn't necessarily asking to say, oh, is she an actress? I don't know her. No, she was trying to confirm, is it the same, maybe like the same actress that actress, owns right? the TV? Exactly. Exactly. That was the question. You know, was because like question. she also said, it was a TV actually conducting that was an interview. Conducting the interview. You know, so they wanted to take a, um, they wanted Omotola's view about what she felt about the, the TV. Channel. You know, the channel. So yeah. she was just trying to confirm, okay, is it the same? Actress, actress that, that owns the TV, that you know, so not necessarily. I don't know her exactly. Who is she? Is she an actress or who exactly and she for is? Me, and you're not yeah. Badmus's reaction, you know, putting there and then the captions. The captions just blew my mind. She was like, Savage answer, um, one day we would, you know, that kind of like vibe. You know, I, I was just like, All right, so personally, again, again, I'm going to say this, right? Some of, some of our celebrities have these over the moon. Mm -hmm idea about themselves. If yeah. somebody doesn't know you, not everybody I knows think it's you. Exactly. The, 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 the people a in Nollywood, I don't know. sense of entitlement. The people in Nollywood, yeah, I don't know. know. She, she was saying, I work harder to the point that I will need no introduction. Thank you for reminding me to put in more work. And I was like, okay. like Complex. I, do you understand? Like, Where is that inferiority complex <laughs> okay. coming I, from? I hear, I hear the I, both of you, but mm -hmm. I, I really need to speak on this. Okay. So, first of all, if we're talking about an Etinosa, no disrespect to any actress out there, right. but if we're talking about all this new generation actresses, maybe mm -hmm. I would say, okay, maybe. But Eniola Badmans is an household name. It's a household name in Nigeria. Yes. Bubu Bee's girl, who doesn't know Bubu yes. girl? Do you understand? Yes. Eniola Badmans um, rose, hold up. Uh, Eniola Badmans. Sorry, I didn't know Bubu Bee's Bu 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 girl. You, not, my first encounter with Eniola was on radio. She yeah, was yeah, but Eniola Badmos is she quite she famous. Also, she's she a Jennifer household Diary. name in Nigeria. She wasn't she, Jennifer she was, Dari. You know, she's she's done like, Ayetoro she Town. Is, is, is it Ayetoro Town? Is or it, you guys, you guys, it, um, no, get something <laughs> ghetto. Omo ghetto. She was in Omo ghetto. So she didn't care. Kid Dele brought out Eniola Badmos. Eniola Badmos rose with Olamide, rose with Davido, rose with Whiskey. 
Okay. That's yes. So I'm supposed to so go up I'm because saying, she no, knows I'm telling you that. No, I'm telling you that she is, she is a household name. So you can't tell me, mm. oh, that's an actress, isn't she? No, to me, I find that very condescending. That's because, because you are There is no way that... And the Motola Jalade will tell me she doesn't know Enola Bagbo. That's because you are interpreting from... Exactly. You are interpreting from that angle. Saying she's an actress, isn't she? She's not saying, I don't know Enola Bagbo. Well, and you know we've had... Exactly. We've had stories. The TV. Exactly. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. And if Enola decided to interpret it that way, to be condescending, that's our interpretation of what Motola Jalade said. And that is not Motola's fault. I said you can't hold Motola Jalade... Everybody is saying Omotola this, Omotola that because of a past history. Omotola has been seen at the airport by a fan that was trying to farm her and then she shot the person down. Oh, Omotola wow. has okay. been at I don't have the, I don't have that. I don't have that experience of Omotola Jalade. Yeah, though. a lot of, that's your personal experience. But a lot of people would say, if you go to the comment section of this now, everybody will tell you, oh, that's how Omotola is. She's such Seriously? a diva. She's this, yeah, she's that. I, Everybody's saying a lot of like negative that. things about but, Omotola right now. But but the person that I know that met Omotola and she kind of like gave her a snobbish attitude. I could understand that. She was coming for a show and then they were like, hey, Omotala, and she didn't answer them. But then I felt like that was like a different scenario entirely from this one. I agree. Jenna said, like, that one can be, okay, she's an actress. Maybe she's not in the mood. It's just like that Tiwa Savage um, situation well, where Tiwa Savage came and she, she did not greet Charles mm -hmm. and Azudu, and she was like, she had a lot of things on her mind. So I, I did not really read much into that. But if people are coming out to say that that is who Omotola is, then I still don't interpret it as shade, but then maybe it is shade to any other badness. And also, I don't think we can categorically say that, okay, Omotola was shading her. But maybe the reason why Eniola Badmus feels that way is because they've had an encounter in the past. Maybe where Omotala acted like she did not know her or she snubbed her or something like that. Maybe that is why. And besides, she they're in the same industry, way. so I bet she knows her better. Exactly. Compared so, to any uh, of us on this table right okay. now. Because <laughs> I, I was trying to find out. If they don't live together, bro. They don't live together. They don't together. live together, but they if, work if together. Set, if a set they're in the same live industry. Together. They're in the same industry, but have they ever worked together? Is there any movie they've done together? True. That's it. True that, though. And and so we can't, we can't just conclude. Together. Sorry, Maybe I'm a little bit personal because I, I know the person of Motola Jalade. Maybe you're being biased. I've had, I've had, no, I've had experience with that. And Ella Badmans has been on my show severally, okay. you know, while I was on radio. And so, um, Omotala Jalade doesn't come off as that kind of person. Not okay, her. maybe because you were the um, I, I, I'm waiting for Motola to respond to this, exactly. so we hope she responds she soon and she says something about this. But yeah. um, it's time for a quick break. Stay with us on Tea Time on Plus TV Right Africa, and we will be right back. Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child. I decide them every day. <laughs> <laughs> Most times, I worry more about where I'm coming from mm -hmm. and where I am now, wow. and that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like Ali Baba? Plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to do Everybody feeling alright. Still buy. Sometimes I look myself, minimal are you? Mm. Apala music is for mature minded people. I got DM sometimes from Malawi, like, woo! Sleeping early, sleeping early. Welcome back to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, and thanks for staying with us. All right, so the next story is on Terry G, who pens down an apology to his baby mm. mama. I think Nimi has an opinion on Rolling this Rolling my eyes. Oh, Why? my God. I read the entire post, and I was just like, blah, 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 blah. Number one, um, we don't know what happened mm. between Terry G and his baby mama. They've been together since 2012. They have a child together. Mm -hmm. You know, we don't know what happened with them. And then we don't know the drama. You, you understand what I'm saying? We don't know what happened that led mm -hmm. to this apology. But you're coming on social media and you're pinning down a very long note, calling on people to help, to beg, you know, your girlfriend. I, for me, it just felt manipulation to me. 
because like I said, we don't know what happened. It could have cheated on her, it could have it could have been domestic violence and then maybe she wanted to walk out and then you're not coming on social media to tell I us. I actually put just... it there that it our committee did not think of all the times where it would hurt her and she would walk away. So it's you actually realizing your mistake. Why do you think it's manipula manipulation when a man realizes it's wrong and is actually apologizing for it to get the woman he loves back? So how is that manipulation? If you call that manipulation, then how are you ever going to the reason comprehend I'm the concept of apology? The reason why I am calling it manipulation is if you wanted to apologize, like I said, the drama happened offline. Mm -hmm. You should have apologized offline. And we don't need to know about what happened in this their is a public relationship. Figure. It is a public figure, right? But we don't know what happened in his relationship life, this public figure. The only thing that we are seeing is the apology part. Why? Why is he coming on social media? I remember media when Cardi B and Offset had their fight. And Offset, Offset had came to go. He to went, a, no, he that was, was also in manipulation a, wait, to me. Why is that manipulation? While he was on stage, he apologized to Cardi B. Oh he put it on his um, social media page. And do everybody you know, praised Offset for Jesus, that. Jesus. I mean, uh, everybody I mean, praised Offset for coming to Cardi B's show, for stopping our show mid concert. To come and apologize for cheating on her, people were praising Offset, mm -hmm. then that is very disappointing. Okay. I am disappointed if they were praising Offset for doing something as out outlandish as that. The right thing would have been to not hurt her in the first place. Not hurting her and then coming and putting on a big show and saying, I'm sorry, so that people can be like, oh my God, Offset is so romantic. No, that is not romantic. It would have been romantic if he did not even cheat on her in the first place. I am sick and tired of men hurting women and then uh -huh. coming. Okay, I'm Would sorry. Come to calm down. <laughs> That's That's generalization right there, man. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. I'm sick. Of men doing what exactly? No, no, no. Some, no, men. some men. Thank you very much. Some Thank men. you very much. Okay. Yeah. Doing very, very hurtful things to their partners and mm. then coming on social media. And most of the time, you know, the reason why I'm angry is because most of the time you don't see these women actually coming out on social media to give their own side of the story. So the only thing that you can judge from is what he put out there, his exorbitant apology, as far as I'm concerned, which is not impressive, is long text of apology, that is the only thing you can see. And I saw comments there, people were saying, oh, it takes a real man to acknowledge his wrongs. And I'm saying, what exactly did he do? I've, I've, I've an opinion on this, for? right? I read, I, read, I read through the whole story and mm -hmm. what Terry G said, I mean, if I'm to get all sentimental, like, oh, pretty, pretty, pretty soft, softened, soft-hearted, tender, mm -hmm. sincere, mm -hmm. truthful apology, mm -hmm. you know? And I said it some, t some time, some days ago on the show, I don't know if it was sometimes last week, that when people make mistakes and they come out to apologize, we make it feel as if it's a big deal mm. for them to apologize. If you did something wrong... I think it was when, um, what's it called? Was this, what's the name of Sam, the producer? Well, Sam Clef, who said the biggest yeah. mistake he made was... Um, you know, our society makes it seem like, oh, it's something really big, oh, God, the man is mm -hmm. accepting his fault, it's he's fault. apologizing. He's apologizing. Bullocks. You were wrong, you were wrong. It's in your place cool. to apologize. Now, exactly. my problem with this apology, like she really said, I wasn't privy to what was going on in his home before now. Exactly. I still don't even know what he did. But if I'm to judge the person of Terry G going by the way we saw him, he projected himself. We were to judge him by the projection of Terry mm. G, the rough, Rass. not care, Ross kind of Alanta. dude. Yeah. <laughs> then we could say he did a whole lot of stuff to her. Maybe he hurt her severely, cheated mm -hmm. on her, mm -hmm. maybe even physically got violent with her. Exactly. We can't say for sure. So we're, we're not privy to what went down between the both of you. And here you are now, tendering... Uh, what seemed to be like a heartfelt apology to our on social media. My, my, my question is, why social media? Exactly. Why should that be the first point? Exactly. That why someone would tell you, maybe, maybe he tried to reach out to her, to her. No. she didn't respond. No. Then you keep trying. You hurt because her privately. Coming right. on social media now, Whatever you did to her to was between to both of you. And so you gotta, you're the man. You got to find a way to make sure you reach out to her mm -hmm. and turn that this apology. So are you also insinuating that this is manipulation? Um, not, not outrightly, but yes, it is. Because now you're going to make the lady look like the bad person. Exactly. People are going to say, you know what, after all, he's Forgive owned up now. to his mistakes. Forgive he's come him. out to the whole wide world. And people you know, are already saying that. I don't like it, that's 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 like it when we it's get to games. pick and choose when no. we oh think God. social media is, is to be put in use. Social media is no, not meant No, we don't. If you start the drama, if you start the drama on social media, then I would understand. Wait, wait, wait. We have people who meet on social media and they get married and they put it out there on social media. Different. You have people Do sharing their that anniversary. Are, I want to ask you a question. Before this apology, did you know there was something wrong between Terry and his baby mama? Did you know? No. 
Exactly. But you're privy to what was going on. No. So this is still... I Did totally I want to about, agree with... Okay, hold on. Did I know about Olu Jacobs and um, Jocke Silva's wedding anniversary? No. But when is their wedding anniversary? They put it out there on social media. It's Why so don't I say... Those are No, they're not so... You're talking about anniversary. You're talking about somebody hurting someone somebody, and they're yeah, coming on social out. media to apologize. Now, when we don't it. even know what this happened. Is this is it, right? As a guy, if I, hurt, if I hurt the woman in my life and I've tried to reach out to her, she's not... She's not She's not. Um, she's given me a brick wall. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to come to social media. Exactly. Because it's not social media's business. It's my mm. private dealing with her. If I do that, let me tell you what this might do. This, what this would definitely do to that lady, it would make her out to be the bad person. Mm -hmm. Or take or like, you back. Know, and no, no, you know what? Okay, okay, she okay has really hurt you. Want. Like society That's would say, eh, That's why I said it's money. That is a man. Eh, okay, has done this. He has mm -hmm. done that. He, he has come to apologize. Now. Accept him back. Exactly. But that's a she, she's going to get a whole lot of that, and that is unfair but to her. She has to write for, for as long as she to wants heal. to grieve and to heal for whatever Teriji did to her. Yeah. So, do I think there's some sort of manipulation? Yes, because the whole world is going to come after her right now. That, eh, okay, has done yeah, it now. She has apologized. That. Anyways, um, to, I'm, to I'm, to I'm going to speak section. for Teriji. Please, um, oh. wifey, baby mama, if you're watching, please forgive our man Teriji. <laughs> <Ta -da. laughs> All, right. All right, so Abby Weinstein to undergo back surgery for injury <laughs> from a car accident which he suffered in August. The disgraced mogul was pictured leaning on two men when appearing at a bail hearing a few days ago. His lawyers have now debunked rumors that he was trying to garner sympathy, stating that Weinstein was in a car crash in August and it resulted in a concussion and has now necessi necessitated the need for a back surgery later this week. PT, 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 PT. They just debunked that. Uh, be, to be honest, I can't pity him, neither am I empathetic to his situation. Abby Weinstein is... Am I allowed to use the word scumbag? He's an actual scumbag, okay? So as far as I'm concerned, this trial should have ended a long time ago. They should have imprisoned this man. It's as a far white as man. I am concerned. He's a white man. But because he's a white man, yeah. this case has gone. Kuba Gooden Jr., Please. who was <laughs> the mm. alleged groping case. Do you know the update on his case now? There are now allegedly seven more women who yeah. have come forward to say yeah, that he groped them. Yeah, women. Avin Weinstein is still out there, and now he has a back surgery. That he needs to. Avi Weinstein has been accused since but how 2017. Is that, wait, wait. How is this back surgery going to affect the case in any way? It's, it's only to help going to. Sympathy no, it's not about. People. It's not about sympathy right now because we know who he is right now. Now we've had A-list actresses come for Avi Weinstein as well, such as Angelina yes. Jolie. Yeah. Do you understand? So there's no case of sympathy in this. A man is going through pain. The fact that he's going through trial shouldn't. He doesn't have the mm -hmm. right to pain and emotions mm -hmm. and. That's, that's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is that the justice system in America is very, very It's pretty, very it's pretty funny. Do you know there's another very, guy? I'm trying to remember his name right now. He was also charged for groping, mm -hmm. groping mm -hmm. other women, a white dude, mm -hmm. and he was sentenced to just um, 14, 14, days. 14 days. No, we'll be talking about I mean, that shortly. It's just, it's just amazing. It is like, ridiculous. We will be talking about then, that shortly. Let's give an example. And then Kelly right and then Cooper Gooden Jr. I mean, are you kidding me? Let's give an example. Um, This man, Bill Cosby. Yeah. Bill Cosby would not have And you guys know that Avi Weinstein is actually, he said, um, he had a hearing recently where he's supposed to pay um, 44, 40, million 44 million dollars yes. settlement. The civil so case to, is to not the, affected. To the women. To the women yeah. and his yeah, um, employees as well to settle them out of court. So, but this is not applicable to the criminal case, yeah, though. So, so this is it. I feel, I feel bad he was involved in a car crash in October that's got in injury to his back. Does, does that alter the case going on? No, it doesn't. So, exactly. I, I, I sympathize with him that he's, he's having back pain right now, but sorry, but bro. I don't think it should um, affect the case going forward. If you forward. did the crime, you, you got to do the and time. And again, I'm even very, very so I don't think this is Because they might affect. use this as an excuse to say, oh, let's, um, let's pity him, his health. Yeah. He cannot go to on jail for... Grounds. On health grounds. Yeah. He can't go to jail for this long. Oh, let us reduce somewhere. his sentence. Or let us take him to another <sighs> kind of prison. Man. I think This man just, is not going to serve just, time for We're all for just human. Crimes. You can't satisfy anybody. We're all just racist. This is racism. This is just racism, blatant racism. We're all just racist, bro. All right. <laughs> We're all just racist. It's time for a break, but we have one more story to discuss. Do not go anywhere. 
Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child at the scene every day. <laughs> Most times, I worry more about where I'm coming from mm -hmm. and where I am now, wow. and that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like Ali Alibaba? Oh, <laughs> Plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to do everybody feeling all right. I still make music and people are still buying. Sometimes I look myself, minimal are you? Mm. Mm. Apala music is for mature minded people. I got DMs sometimes from Malawi, like, what? <laughs> <laughs> sleeping early, sleeping early. <laughs>
it's not overcrowded for, for, it's not okay for any Bill black Cosby. Bill Cosby. It's for never any, ever crowded for, for any... black men. It's never. Oh, it, no. But it's for this white. This is terrible. Men. This is terrible. Yeah, we're and... color. Yeah, we're color blind, but racism exists. Bro. And I think we're getting to that level in Nigeria as well. So really? where people are. Favoring the rich and then the yeah, poor. Yeah, well, yeah, that's yeah. always been the system. Yeah, yeah, that's so. always been the system. That's but that's how we is. wrap up on this episode of Tea Time. Thank you for watching. And remember, you can catch up on this episode and all our exclusive content by subscribing to our YouTube channel, Applause TV Africa. You can watch Tea Time on Alto TV and in London and Ben Television. Big shout out to my co anchors, Nimi and Benny, for holding us down and the entire production team. I'm your fellow Welsh and saying thank you for watching.